Okay, so the sound quality for some reason came out really bad in that last video, and I don't know why I apologize for that. So I'm gonna redo it. This time I've had some time to cool off, so I'm not gonna leave Dragon no messages because he's heard what I have to say, or he will hear it when he gets on. But I'm gonna play the message because, yeah. Now, remember, I just got online when I got this message. I was on once earlier. I talked to Lord Bob. That was it. I haven't really been on. So, I'm trying to take a break because, you know, it's been a hard, hard week for me. Hell, it's been a hard month. But, you get the point. The point is, I'm online because I'm taking a break. Now, I'm going to play the message. As of right now, I will be removing anyone and everyone that is associated with cute Applejack from a day from now. Message me back, you do. I'm going to play it again because, come on, it's amazing. As of right now, I will be removing anyone and everyone that is associated with cute Applejack from a day from now. Message me back, you do One more time. As of right now, I will be removing anyone and everyone that is associated with cute Applejack from a day from now. Message me back, you do Now let's recap to what happened between Applejack and Dragon about a month ago. And I don't want to recap this because I don't give a shit. But let's go back here a minute. Let's rewind. It's been about a month. About a month earlier, uh, Dragon one day decided to remove Applejack out of the blue. Said that Applejack said something to him about his gamer tags. He did this... Well, it started off funny because, you know, I joined the party and Dragon's like, Take a look at my face friends list. Tell me what you see. You know, acting all weird and shit. I expected that something was up. Took a look. Didn't see Applejack. And then he told me he removed everybody who was a problem or could present a problem. Forgot how he phrased it, but since that day, he's been avoiding Applejack. You know, he's been acting like there's a war between him and Apple. And, uh, it's been going good. Apple hasn't really complained about it or anything. And, you know, I don't bother to get them in parties or anything. So I've been hanging out with them separately. When I can get online, that is. I know I haven't been online of recently. But you get the point. Then he starts bringing up Applejack out of the blue. This started about a week ago. Maybe two weeks ago now, actually. Yeah, no, it's been that long. But anyway, he starts bringing out Applejack, and it's like, you know, none of us even mention it. So he just brings it up. So, you know, I tell Dragon, I want to hear no more shit about Applejack, because I don't care about... I don't care about Dragon's problems with Applejack. I just, I don't. That That's between him and Apple. Okay, so think everything's cool and no mention of Applejack whatsoever and then today I get on and I get this message get this message now keep in mind both of my parents are in the hospital my dad's in the hospital because he's had a nervous breakdown he's he's having severe depression okay not gonna go into detail my mom's in the hospital because she's having health problems. Okay. I'm literally filling in for my entire family. So as you can see, I got problems of my own. Now here we have Dragon complaining about Applejack. Throwing a hissy fit over somebody on Xbox Live who he's removed and blocked communications with. For whatever reason. Dragon. Don't take this the wrong way. If I seem like an asshole, I'm not going to apologize. If I seem like an asshole, that's because I'm sick of your shit. 
I mean, it is quite annoying to get on Xbox and hear you throw just a fucking giant tantrum fit over Xbox. You are not a fucking king. You do not wear a fucking crown. And most importantly, you do not run Xbox Live. Okay? Get over it. Take that fucking ego of yours and shove it up your ass for one fucking minute. Okay? Nobody cares about your drama. Nobody gives a fuck. We are on Xbox to relax, to play games, to have fun, and to get away from our problems. Not to fucking put up with you. Do you understand? That That's like getting really annoying to me. Because, you know, I come on and the first thing I want to do is spend some time with friends and relieve stress. And then in here I got this fucking message. This message. Now, I could block communications with you and ignore it, but this this is just becoming a big headache. It's one thing after another with you people. Not just dragging with other people, too. I mean, oh my god. I don't know why I'm on Xbox now. I'm tempted to fucking sell the Xbox and get a PS3. Seriously, if this is all Xbox is, whiny little stuck-up brats who have no lives? Yes, Dragon, you have no life. You sit on Xbox in your computer 24-7 while your parents go out, buy you dinner, make your bed. Oh, well, they buy you dinner, they fucking buy you games, they buy you everything you want or need, practically. And then they do your laundry, they cook the dinner, they take out the trash, they do everything for you. Well, you sit home, 23 years old, playing games on your ass, not worked a day in your life, and here you are bitching about somebody you removed on Xbox for something they said to you that you didn't like. Whatever that was, something about a gamer tag. What the fuck ever, dude, I don't care. And nobody's going to remove Applejack just because you bark orders like you're some sort of tyrant. Jesus Christ, Dragon. Grow the fuck up.